Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Frederick Krasikowski Lloyd and I am certified reflexologist, dietitian and naturopath. Today I will show you how you can help yourself if you got any problems with thyroid glands. Let's start. The thyroid is part of the endocrine system which is made up of glands that produce, store and release hormones into body cells. The thyroid gland is about 7 cm long and lies in front of your throat below the Adam's apple. The thyroid gland uses iodine from the food you eat to make two main hormones, T4 tyroxine and T3 triiodothyroine. And this is very important that T3 and T4 levels are neither too high nor too low. The first important point is on the spinal column just below C7. I said below because you need to find it. And then press C7 from bottom to top at angle of 45 degrees or grab your big toe and press C7 like that. This direction is easy. There is also what I called thyroid triangle. There are a lot of nerve endings at this area and at the end of it there are parathyroid points here and here. Quite hard to find them, so it's better to walk. Next very important and rarely shown point is thyroid plexus. And its reflex point is at the base of the first phalanx of the big toe. So edge of the big toe, C7 on spine, put your thumb over here and there you go, thyroid plexus. Press and hold, like that. So the best you can do is walk everywhere in this area, up and down, doesn't matter, like me now. And press and hold thyroid plexus. You know, plexuses are energetic nervous centers, a kind of crossroads where the nerves are brought together. That's why this point is extremely important. So walk here and press and hold the points. And on the top of the first phalanx of the big toe, there are a lot of thyroid nerves endings. And we need to walk here up and down as well. But to be honest, this part of your foot sometimes is very painful. If you have too much T3 or T4, which is called hyperthyroidism, you can experience anxiety, irritability or moodiness, nervousness, hyperactivity, sweating, hand shaking, hair loss, mist or light menstrual period. Kidney 7 is one of the most powerful acupressure points that are beneficial for treatment of hypothyroidism. It's situated on the medial aspect of the lower leg, at the border of the Achilles tendon, too soon above point K3. K3 is just behind the inner ankle. And what is the sun? Basically this is the width of the receiver thumb. Someone may ask why receiver, because this is the most exact measurement. So press and hold like that for 5-6 seconds and then repeat 3-4 times. If you have too little T3 or T4 in your body, which is called hypothyroidism, you can experience trouble sleeping, tiredness, difficulty concentrating, dry skin and hair, depression, sensitivity to cold temperature. P6 is very important pressure point in acupressure therapy for treatment of hyperthyroidism. Point P6 is located too soon above the wrist crease in between the palmaris longus and flexor carpi radials tendons. Please press and hold for 5-6 seconds and then repeat 3-4 times per session. On the palm of the hand the reflexes are next to the thumb. There is also thyroid plexus which is powerful energetic nervous center which should be pressed from bottom to top as I show you now. And here this area between the proximal phalanx and metacarpal bones. There are reflexes of thyroid. You should walk there and press as deep as you can. And now I will tell you about sign your feet are warning you about thyroid problem. Dry or cracked feet with calluses, 
cold feet, swollen feet. Actually, edema is classic symptom of hypothyroidism, but also it may be connected with heart disease, kidney dysfunction or diabetes. Foot pain and cramping. Very characteristic kind of pain is a cramp along the bottom of the foot when you step out of bed in the morning. Some sensations in the feet such as pins, needles or tingling. Foot infections including athlete foot and onychomycosis. And also smelly feet. That's a sign your feet are warning you about your thyroid problem. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you later.